This is a very quick video to show you how to upload an image file to Physiopedia. We do this on the Upload File page, and to get to this, you go to the Tools drop-down navigation bar and choose Upload File, and this will bring you to this page where you can upload your image file. Before you can upload an image, you need to make sure it's been uploaded to your computer. I did this earlier, so let's go to the next step, go down and click on Choose File. Now let's find the image file that I want to upload. Here is the image that I added earlier, the brachial plexus. Let's click on that and you can see that the source name is here. The same as the name on my computer. And it automatically adds a destination file name for me. In this case, it is appropriate and will allow anyone to find the name in the future. And we use the file that sometimes the name is not so obvious. It might just be a number, it might not have a name that can be easily recognised. So it is important that the destination file name is a good description of the image. If it isn't, you can change it. So let's scroll down the page where we can now see a summary box. This is where we can add information about the image that we found, such as attributions and credits. Now I found this page on Wikimedia Commons, so let us go and find the original image. So to find the image details on Wiki, Wikimedia Commons, let us click this download button here. You can see that the image URL, any attributions, and also the licensing details. So now I can copy the URL and any other details that I want, so that I can go back and paste them into the image file summary box. You can also see it has a Creative Commons license share alike for. So now let's go back to the upload file page and let's paste the information into the summary box. We let, and now we've done that, let us go down and select the licensing options. This will automatically add the appropriate license for me. As you can see, there are lots of different licenses to choose from, so please try and choose the one that reflects the licensing of the image that you are using. So let's choose the correct license for our image, which will share a like Creative Commons 4. You can now see that this has automatically been added and the appropriate license appears on the page for me. So that's all I need to do to upload the file. So let's go down and upload the file now. Once the file is uploaded, it creates a separate page, the file page in Physiopedia. The image file page contains the summary information and the licensing details. It also tells me which pages that the image appears on. But as this is a new image, there are no pages there as yet. You can also edit this page at any time. You can upload a replacement image and you can even edit the summary and licensing information. To do this, we need to edit the source code. So we go to the Edit drop-down menu bar and choose the Edit Source option. Now if we look at the page, you can see that the licensing information has automatically been added by a template. And we can edit this template if we, if we want to. And this is useful if the license is wrong or maybe it hasn't been added previously to the, to the image page. But for, for this instance, we're just going to add some additional text. So let's add attribution to the summary text here. Let's save our page and go back and look at our edits. So now that you can, you can see the edits that I made to the text are here. This is all we need to do to upload an image to Physiopedia.